Oh, hello there. Didn't quite see ya. My name's Cody Maverick, and you might be wondering, why is there a dead body near you? Well, I'll tell you why. This man was Jeffrey, and he was a great soul, doing community service on the weekends and taking extra shifts to pay his mom's hospital bills. Jeffrey was a great kid. Now, because of sharks, he has lost his life. With a heavy heart, I ask for your help on November 4th to vote for me so no one again ends up like poor Jeffrey right here. A vote for Maverick is a vote against sharks. Thank you, thank you, yes. And I owe this all to my friend that... What? What's your name? Oh, me? Yeah, Wait, you... oh, oh, you mean me? Oh, you never asked me your name before. Just say your name, kid. Quick, quick, quick. Uh, Sidious! My name is Sidious! You, we, I owe this all to Sidious. He has helped me. Yep, now this you. shock. Hello, that... everyone! Sidious, Hello. sit down. Sit oh. Down. Sorry, sorry. Get the camera, aim it on me. Sorry, got it. Now this shark that attacked Jeffrey. You citizens do not need to worry. I am patrolling the waters, me and my team. And when we are elected mayor of all shoreline towns, we will get rid of the sharks. For I have a plan that I am announcing first. Right here, right now, to you all you good people that have come to the parking lot. And we set up a movie for you to watch. You guys are going to be watching, um, I think it's Cinderella's after this. The live action one by Disney. Uh, and you, you came here with your own free will to help me and also watch this movie. City's back up. Oh, sorry, I was just getting a close up. Further, further. And, and also, there's free pizza over on the side. But I want to reward you for this. Today marks the day where we will soon be able to construct a wall. How long is he been at it? Sidious, say dun dun dun. Did, Sidious, where are you? Dun dun dun! <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting a back shot. Epic looking. The wall will be built to keep all those sharks. Sidious, out of the shot. Out of the shot! <laughs> Oh, All those pesky sharks out of our town and our beaches. Okay, okay. <clears throat> Hi. Hey, how did you get it? Stop coming up. Everybody's ruining my speeches. You don't have permission to build a wall. What do you mean I don't have permission to build a wall? Y you don't have permission to build a wall. No, it's build a wall. No. We're going to keep... All those animals away that are bad. Citizens. Sharp teeth, pointy teeth, they are out. Anything that is good, like a turtle, they get to come in. Now, the sharks, we do not hate sharks. They are important to our ecosystem. That is why Thank they you. will be safe beyond the wall, away from our children. <laughs> what are you gonna do about the other creatures? They're all gonna get caught in your wall too? You're gonna have some bycatch on your wall? We will have people patrolling this wall, making sure nothing bad happens. And that it works. It, this way, we still love sharks, but they don't come to the beach or I'm our gonna town. I'm going to this to you, man. There's nothing to worry about anymore. I'm going to prove it to you. Crack and I, what? we've had experience with that one. You know how he came to this town? A drift. Sidious, shot on me, me! I, I'm looking at you! He came to this town as a drifter. Didn't know what way was up or down. And he took after me and went to the police station. And look at him now. He's fallen so far from the apple tree. Oh. No worries. Elect me! Your mayor. November 4th. A vote for me is a vote against sharks. Pokemon go to the polls! Is that good, Sidious? Wow. Ugh, 
That man makes me so mad! <sighs> Angela, what do you think about this whole mess? Well, it kind of makes sense, sir. What? Are, are you kidding me? It makes sense? He says just because he had a bad experience with sharks, it doesn't mean they're all <laughs> murderers? Oh, oh, I can't believe he said that. Grace, please tell me you don't think that way, too. I think sharks are scary, but that doesn't mean they are evil. Exactly! Sharks! Okay, so I'm not going crazy. You agree with me then. Okay. <sighs> Alright, I, I, I need to get to the station. I, I, I gotta do something to prove to Cody that sharks aren't all that bad, dude. And then the Joss isn't coming back. He's not coming back. He's gone. We haven't seen him a great white in forever. Alright, we're gonna go back to the police station. Gonna get the boat, and I'm gonna head out to where it all happened. I'm gonna go to Jaws's cave and find out if it's truly empty or not. Killing all sharks just because one was bad is like killing all bees because one stung you. And guess what? We'd have no food on Earth if we did that because bees pollinate all the plants. Ugh. Sometimes I get so tired of explaining it. What, Angela? Didn't I just see you at the thing? Grace? How'd you guys get back? Got your scuba gear all ready, sir. It's in the locker. Oh, and we tried to yell at you to see if you wanted to ride back because we drove. Oh, uh, yep, yeah, I must not have heard you. Sorry, I was a little busy, okay? I, I really want to get this. Thank you for getting my scuba gear. That was very nice of you. All right, so she said you put it in the locker. Let's see. Yes, there it is. Awesome. All right, so I don't know which mask I'm going to want to wear. I'll take them all. We're headed out into the ocean. If I'm not back in a few hours, come looking for me. It might not be good. Ah, I'm just kidding. There's nothing out there to be afraid of because there's no more Jaws. So this is just going to be a routine mission to talk some sense into Cody. I'll wait. I'm putting my scuba stuff in. <sighs> I don't know what I'm going to do with that guy. Oh, I shouldn't have took the shelf. Hello, sir. Just going to be taking out the Coast Guard ship. <laughs> Got to uh, do a little shark hunting. Somebody says he thought you saw a shark. What's up, Mr. Fisherman? How are they biting today? All right, let's see if I remember how to do this thing. Okay, we just gotta slowly reverse out. Look at that. Just like riding a bike. I haven't driven one of these things in probably about a year or two. Okay, keep going. Beep, beep. Oh, wrong way. Gotta cut it, cut it the other way. Turn, turn, turn. And... We're off. So guys, we are looking for something on our radar here. We're looking for a big blip in it. Because I think the cave wasn't too far from here. It might be just on the outside of this reef. So basically, we're just looking for anything on these here electronics that show anything out of the ordinary. But, uh, because that, that was a pretty big cave, so it should be a pretty good sized mark that we see. Alright, so we'll throttle up a little bit. <clears throat> Hang on, it says we got something ahead of us. Yep, we got something that is definitely unusual. It does not look like normal bottom up ahead of us. All right, we're gonna have to stop and check this out. This might be it, guys. This might be the spot we might have found. Jaws' cave. His little layer. It's gonna be our little layer. All right, we're, we should be just about over it. All right, let me just put this thing in park. All right, guys, I am all suited up and ready to go check out whatever this is in the water and see if it's as scary as Cody's diaries. That's right, I have read his diaries, but only because I'm trying to figure out what's wrong with my friend, okay? He, he, he's he gone through some stuff and he talks about these caves, Jaws Lair, as some like really creepy place and like a lot of bad stuff happens there. Well, we're gonna go find out. And that that's today's goal here. And see if there's really anything to be worried about or not. We're gonna do a cannonball into the water. Dude, let, my boat's trying to stop me, there we go. All right, so these must be them. We gotta keep an eye on our oxygen. Actually, I know I'm gonna go up, refresh it right now, and then we'll come back down. <sighs> okay. This doesn't really look like a cave. It looks more, like more man-made. What's underneath here? You know what? If I had to make a guess, I'd say this is some sort of shipwreck. Do you think it could be the, lo the lost boat of Salamander? No, I mean, they gave up. There's no way it would be this close to Animity Island. You know, it, like, it was... The, the fight happened so far away. Do you think it really could have drifted in this far? 
Huh. I wonder if there's like a crack in the hull. There is right here. Okay, there's a crack in the hull. We could we could literally go inside. Looks like some underwater owls found their way in too. Let's see. Yeah, dude, I'm pretty sure this is definitely his ship. Oh my gosh, I gotta I gotta book it up to the top. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. It looked like I see a body down there, but I, I can't be certain. I just gotta get up to the top and then we'll come back down and check it out. Come on. Come on, please. I'm gonna have to be so close. It's gonna be so close. Oh, oh I can breathe. I can breathe. Whew. Ah, that's a lot better. All right, we gotta go back down, guys. I think I might have seen a body. Is somebody down here? It's just another owl. No, it's not. It, it's it, it's a calibrator, dude. This, this is a ship. Oh my gosh. His body looks like he just died. It's completely lifeless, but he, he died like years and years ago. It must be the, the salt water is preserving his body. Oh my gosh. I wonder if this will bring closure to Cody and it'll prove that Calamander's dead and he has nothing to worry about. Oh man, I gotta get back to town. But, uh, I can't go back yet. I, I, I've come this far. I owe it to myself and to Cody to try to look for the caves to put his mind at rest. I, I got I gotta go back out there guys. We will come back to get his body though. We <laughs> this is amazing. I am going to be the hero of the town if I bring back Calamator's body. This is just unbelievable. Alright, so we gotta keep looking for another blip in the radar. Hopefully the next one we find is the actual cave. Alright guys, before we go any further, I should probably get the coordinates of the wreck. Negative 698, 63, negative 181. That way I can come back and recover the body safely when I have a bigger crew with me. Now, let's just continue on our journey and hopefully we will stumble upon the caves that Cody so often talks about. Dun -dun. Dun -dun. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Just kidding. It's just me. Still searching, no jaws, no sharks. Well, my boat broke down, so I'm on the life raft right now, guys. Uh, I did spot something dead ahead, though. And, I, I, and as soon as I seen it, the engine shut off, wouldn't turn back on, so I hopped in the little jiffy, and it looks like we might have an actual hole over there. Not sure if it's the cave yet, but we're gonna check it out. <sighs> I just get this weird feeling. I, I hope this is it. Looks like if we just park it right here, we should be good to go. I'm only gonna have... Uh. Ooh, excuse me. Shouldn't eat those bacon cheeseburgers for lunch. I'm not gonna have too much time down there, guys, but... Seems like we're in the middle of nowhere. Let's go! Alright, we gotta watch our air. This is... This has got to be it, dude. He, he mentioned the spikes on the walls. And then the secondary tunnel. This is it, guys. This is the one we've been looking for. I don't think I'm going to be able to go deep inside that secondary tunnel, but let's get a close look. And I'm kind of getting a little freaked out, to be honest. This is where it happened. This is where... This is where Jaws lived. And what I would have given to see... Ah, Cody, take him down. Alright, this is probably as close as I want to get. What was that? Oh man, I gotta get out of here! I gotta get out of here! <laughs> swim, swim, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. 